Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. We're doing a production of Flat Stanley, the musical adventures of Flat Stanley, which is based on a children's book. And it's about a little boy who makes a wish on a star, and his wish comes true in a not so regular kind of way. My child is flat, except his fingers, except his toes. Flat Stanley, flat I play his mother, who is um, lovely and supportive, and um, apparently a little permissive to let her child go across the world, but uh, it wouldn't be a show. I play Stanley. He's uh, your average, everyday kid who just has a bunch of heroes, um, and he wants to see the world and do amazing things that no one's ever seen before. I read the the Flat Stanley book, just Flat Stanley, when I got the role, um, and I did read the books as a kid, but I didn't really remember them that much, so I figured do a little bit of character research and read the book just so I knew who I was playing. One of my favorite moments in the show has to be when they, um, like the first reveal of Stanley, um, just because, you know, you get that reaction from the kids and, you know, everybody, everybody knows it's going to happen, but it's like the anticipation of seeing the costume itself. Look at you, Stanley. You're postal perfect. Why, you could go almost anywhere for the price of a stamp. I played Mrs. Cartero, the male woman. I played the bulletin board, a Hollywood assistant and a surfer girl. It's a lot of fun. It moves very quickly. You have to be prepared to what is coming next because if you forget and you come on with the wrong costume. People should come out uh, with their families to see this show because it's just so much fun. Uh, every number is exciting. All the music is very upbeat and you know, it's just a, a nice way to spend your weekend here in Northport on a lovely spring day. I play Mr. Lambchop, uh, Dr. Dan, a surfering director in the movie scene, and uh, Napoleon the painting. Action! I have a lot of fun in the Surfing in the Mail song because I get to run around with the shark head on and goggles and I can't see anything, but I'm still doing a dance number and it's, that's a lot of fun. What would you wish for if you could wish on a falling star? Well, I wish for an A on my science test tomorrow. I play Arthur, uh, the little brother, uh, Herb Wavecrest, the entertainment reporter, and the Hollywood producer. I have a monologue in the middle of, of Act One where I come on and I'm telling the story of how the cool kids of the school came and turned Stanley into a kite because now he's flat and he got stuck in a tree and it's Arthur being stuck between helping his brother or going on the bus with the cool kids. Stanley's definitely dead and I'm totally grounded. Ah! I love doing the I wish I were number with Hans who plays Flat Stanley who's my older brother in the show. Um, Hans and I are best friends in actual life so to get to do that song with him is a lot of fun. It's just, it's, it's like we're, it's real life on stage because we are so close. I wish I were a hero and I could have an adventure. I think the lesson is be yourself, you know, um, and also it's kind of be careful what you wish for because Stanley makes this grand wish of being a hero and doing amazing things and he winds up flat, which is not necessarily everyone's opportune wish, I'd say. <laughs> I'm gonna look on the sunny side, no matter what they say. Look on the sunny side. Who cares if it's cliche? Being flat's exciting. At least it's something new. Should 